Hi everybody, I'm Chris from Sparkfun Electronics and uh, I'm here today to talk about magnetometers. Uh, magnetometers are most commonly used as digital compasses, meaning they can detect their position relative to the Earth or north. So here I have uh, a simple two-axis magnetometer uh, hooked up to an Arduino. The Arduino is communicating with the servo, so when I rotate the digital compass, it changes the direction of the arrow on the servo based on where I'm pointing the digital compass. So basically the HMC6352 is detecting north on the two axis and uh, putting them together. So when it's queried by the Arduino, uh, it sends a heading from 0 to 360, meaning it has one degree accuracy, and uh, it does this at 20 hertz. So it's send sending its strongest magnetic field over this, this 360 degree range. So right now, this is just detecting a heading. Um, it's detecting north, or the strongest magnetic field it sees in the area. But if I tilt this, it, won't, it will no longer work properly. It, uh, it's receiving junk data because it's not tilt compensated. We sell uh, the HMC6343, which is tilt compensated, meaning that it can tilt to a certain degree and still take a, a north heading. Uh, meaning that your robot doesn't have to be perfectly flat all the time. Uh, also, when this, uh, this magnetometer comes within the range of a magnet, it starts to uh, lose its bearings because it now is looking for north from the magnet, or it's now detecting north uh, from this magnet. So I move it around and it thinks, it knows this is the strongest magnetic field in the area and it's detecting the magnet instead of north. Once I take it away, it has to be recalibrated because uh, the Hall effect sensors have felt too strong of a magnetic field. SparkFun sells five other magnetometers, uh, all with different communication protocols, um, some three axis, some two axis. They range from simple to complicated, and some even include accelerometers on board, so they can be used for more advanced applications. So if you uh, needed a robot or a project to know its direction, then uh, this is what you want and thanks for watching.